Here we're going to demonstrate the hardware flow shunting capabilities in the Napatek SmartNIC, and we're going to compare that against doing the shunting on a standard server NIC. We're using a separate server to generate the traffic. Basically, it's replaying a, a PCAP file, and we're using the full default rule set with Suricata. And it's a full integration with Suricata, so we will write a simple rule to shunt certain types of traffic. So here's the rule. We're basically shunting everything except those TCP ports. So we're doing a bypass rule within Suricata. And first thing we're going to show is what's achievable on this standard server NIC we're using uh, in this demonstration. And so here we are generating 28 gigabits of traffic into Suricata. You can see the HTOP window. We have activity. Uh, all the CPU cores are being utilized, not fully utilized, but they're being utilized. The interface we're using here is the AF packet interface. And now let's up it to 32 gigabits per second. And, and now you can see we're seeing some packet drops. So that's the, the limit you can push the standard NIC doing shunting and software. Here's the Napatech uh, demonstration. In this window here, we have the activity with all the incoming packets and all the, the packet streams, the HTOP window. We also are seeing that we're, we're dropping or shunting a significant amount of traffic, and we're doing that all in hardware, again using the same exact rule that we used in the demo using the standard NIC. Here we're, we're just shunting uh, packets, and this part of the demonstration we're doing near line speed. Both 40 gigabit interfaces on the Napatek card, so you can see we're doing about 38 gigabits per port, which approximately is a 2.7 times improvement in performance over a standard net. Okay, so that's the demo. Thank you very much for watching.